Our Oregon adventure continues. In this episode, we go back to Wildwood State Park in Oregon to the Stream Watch to share that experience with our daughter. It was awesome. Come along and check it out. What an epic trip this has been. We've done and seen so much already. We're back at the Stream Watch Cascade Trail at Wildwood. My daughter's here taking the walk. We definitely want to show her the little fish window. And the sun is shining. So let's see what the creek looks like with the sun shining. Here's the, here's the anti-graffiti tree. You guys, you can see the other episode where it shows a lot more of the trail. We're just showing you little bits right here. You want to see the view of the creek right here? The river, actually, this is the Salmon River. I know the steam's so cool. Oh, sun, glorious sun. Ah. It's still sh very shady, bless you. Very shaded along the water still. shorts at the store here. They're badass. Also, I wouldn't even invest those things off the side of the road anyway because of the asphalt. Oh. The oils, the mushrooms you take. Ew, yeah. All the surrounding. Right. Areas. Makes sense. You can smell how moist you... that. Aww. That sucks. I love the carved benches too, they're really neat. There's a fishing spot. Yeah, so cool, yeah, private little campsite. I mean, picnic sites. Yeah. Continuation to Bobby's notches in the redwood tree. Yeah, so this picture shows where these guys would stick their boards in. The notch kind of goes down a little bit like this. So when they stick their board in and put their weight on it, it kind of evens out. And it goes evenly around the trunk, so two guys could sit up there, swing an axe, one hits, one still swinging, and just take turns, or a saw. We stayed in the campsite earlier on vacation, but I found these great big notches at, and I thought it was a point of choking trees to this point to be hauled out, but it's actually tree stands. I thought you did that for a second guess. I did. That, yeah. I did. First you thought that, and then you said, oh, maybe it's that. Because they're even the thought, yeah. Very good, very good. Thank you, sir. Thank you. It's a test Friday. <laughs> For the big reveal. Oh, I didn't see that. That's kind of cool. Oh, neat. Ta -da. Oh, it is higher. Look at that. It is, it is a little higher than the other day. There's a little fish. Little fish. Two little fishes there in the wild. Oh, the Three little fishes. Gone. Oh, and the snails are gone. They must have got washed away. I, I guess the rain rose. Okay, what kind of fish is this fish? I said these are salmon or. I said, uh, kanduk or whatever that salmon is. So we, we hung out here in another video, so check that out too, it's super cool, recommend. We're headed to Timberline Lodge. Mount Hood National Forest. I think that's Mount Hood behind it. Destination unknown. <laughs> lots of history, <clears throat> lots of cool structures. 
go ahead and pause and read this if you like. Not everybody likes history like I do. I don't want to bore anybody. I did read this last night, how they made it from the stone and the wood and the iron and everything from around. There's the architect architectural renderings. The inspiration. We're leaving Wildwood. You can see there's much more people here than before. Yeah, there's the Blue Ox Bar. There's carvings, wood carvings throughout. The main lobby looks amazing. The chimney, I can't wait to see the chimney. Chimney. Chim chimney. The mezzanine. Yeah, cannot wait. And we love this little trail area. We went down there and there's a cool bridge that goes over the river. Originally, I was gonna take you there too, but we kind of got lost. She's practically on her lap. <laughs> I know we told at one point. Was me, I'm like, I don't care. I'm just like, we're doing. He's pretty impressed. It's about to go in the clouds again, too. I freaking saw it. I freaking saw you. <laughs> oh my god, it's as magnificent as I thought. I cannot wait to get a better look. All right there, it goes behind the trees. Wow. I said a wah wah. Don't forget to stop and smell the flowers. There's some shit I like to fix, but I still know that I'm blessed.